everybody on YouTube. I'm Zelda Wolfgang, also known as the Mitch and Hunter, known as the Master of All Spellcasters. Just a quick disclaimer, that you're going to hear me get angry. Why? Because I really hate this episode. How much do I hate this episode? Well, let's just say that not only I consider this the worst episode of the entire season, but the entire series itself. That's how much I hate this episode. Well, sit back and watch me get angry. This episode starts off with Rarity and Spike handing out flyers for a fashion contest for new beginners, which that's not a bad start, but then it goes downhill when Rarity announces the judges. First, it's photo finish. Good start. The second judge, Hoity Toity. And the final judge, what the fuck? Applejack. No, seriously, what the fuck is Applejack doing as a judge? It turns out Rarity didn't even consult or even told Applejack that she's a judge. She just says, she's a judge. Okay, that's not really good planning. You can't just say that person is automatically a judge for a contest without consulting the person. That's horrible planning. And do you want to know why Rarity says Applejack? Well, it's because she's honest. She has lied before. And because she's practical. Practicality can only get you so far in fashion. And also, there's more to fashion than practicality. And another thing I want to point out. Applejack has no experience with fashion. That's like saying you're asking a person who played Magic the Gathering ever since the game came out and then tell that person he's a judge for Yu-Gi-Oh! You should know that wouldn't work because the person wouldn't know what the hell they're doing. So after AJ helped Apple Bloom with her hat, she decides to say, fuck it, I'll be a judge anyway. We then meet our contestants, Inky Rose, Lily Lays, and Star Trek. Now, I will say I didn't really care for these characters, especially Lily Lays. Now, I'm not saying they're bad characters or that I hate them. I just don't really care for them. Then the episode decides to make Applejack look like a complete bitch for the sake of the plot by having her insert her opinions on others even though that she doesn't know what the hell she's doing and destroying other ponies clothing even though they put a lot of work into it. But that's not the worst part. Oh no my friends, the worst part is when Applejack calls fashion ridiculous and says it's my opinion. You know what this is? This is the writers trying to pick a fight with the critics. Well, hate to break it to you, but we already had two episodes that already talked about opinions like Spice Up Your Life and Stranger Than Fan Fiction. And they did it a lot better. As for this episode, it fucking failed at it. Now, for some, what broke the camel's back was when Applejack says fashion is ridiculous. Well, not for me. What really broke the camel's back was when Rarity blames everything on Applejack. Where the fuck do I begin? One, Rarity, you're the one who put Applejack in this position without consulting her. Two, you had the power to stop her but stood there and did nothing. And three, and finally, you asked Applejack to be honest as possible. What did you think was going to happen? Also, Applejack learned the lesson that the truth may hurt, but a lie would be worse at season four. So Rarity takes Applejack to some pony who loves strawberries and tells Applejack that she doesn't like apples. And Applejack throws a fucking fit about it. Some say this is giving Applejack a taste of her own medicine. It would have been if it wasn't coming from the pony who put her up to all of this and being so snobbish about it. So Applejack ends up kidnapping the judges and the contestants and doesn't apologize for how she acted in calling fashion ridiculous. This is not the Applejack I know and love. Believe it or not, if Twilight didn't exist, I would have considered Applejack best pony because of all the great things she does. So after the fashion show is finished, it's all up to Applejack to decide the winner of the contest because it's a tie. So who does she pick? All of them, making this a huge fucking cop-out. The point of all of this was to pick one winner. That's the point of a contest. Basically, the writer of this episode didn't fucking proofread this. After the fashion show is over, Rarity shows Applejack a shitty dress, and Applejack is nervous to say it sucks because she's afraid of being put down as the bad guy again, until Rarity says it sucks. Wow, this is just bad. Just fucking bad. My final score is F for fuck this episode minus. So my next review is going to be a calmer one. My next review is going to be Once Upon a Zeppelin. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in my next review.